Hello to you and welcome to this short clip on the AppVision Building Manager. AppVision is a state-of-the-art physical security management software system, or PSIM as it's called these days, that is used for integrated command and control of security and building automation systems. AppVision is the world's leading open architecture PSIM product and was last year deployed every 1.7 days at a new project. This also means that our product is very well tested and is very stable. The goal of a command and control project is to centralise data in real time from different assets that will inherently be from different manufacturers. But the key to a project is making sense of the various sources of data and most importantly assisting the security personnel make important decisions very rapidly. In this first presentation we are going to see how simple it is to import a new graphic into the AppVision supervisory screen, the screen that we are now looking at. Our demonstration version comes with an in-house graphic which we can see here. You can also see the various navigation icons at the bottom of the screen. I'm going to show you a very simple way to build graphic user interfaces for a town centre project. I am an administrator on this installation of AppVision and as such can access all the various parts of the software including the built-in graphic editor. I have now opened the graphic editor. Please remember that some products out there do not provide you with a graphic editor and you are just provided with a, an end runtime version. This would mean that even though you have already bought and paid for your system you would still have to go back to the software manufacturer for any modifications or alt alterations. This is not the case with AppVision. Watch now as I open a new container and I set the screen resolution which if I want to take the full screen on this machine is 1600 by 900 but each screen may be different. Once I've set the size I'm going to import an existing graphic that I already saved on my machine. In this case it's a map of Glasgow. All I have to do now is save the map, give it a name, in which case I'm going to call it Glasgow. As you can see I already have a file called Glasgow. I'm going to overwrite the file and I've now finished with the graphic editor for this very simple part of the presentation. I'm now back in the supervisory part of the screen and by opening a hidden menu with the control F of the keyboard I can open the file called Glasgow. Once I've redimensioned the screen, if I wanted this to be my permanent uh, graphic user interface, all I would have to do is go to tools and save the user environment. The software would ask me for my password and once entered this would be my graphic user interface which would be the permanent uh, screen in front of me when I start AppVision. Thank you for listening.